swear. You keep banging, I swear. You got it. You got the count of ten. Come on along, I'll take you to the lullaby of Broadway. Hippery and Valley The lullaby of Broadway. And in the center of it all is the Milford Plaza. Stay at the Milford Plaza Hotel with cocktail dinner and breakfast for $43 per person. Discover why we are the lullaby of Broadway. The Milford Plaza is the lullaby of What's up folks, Explorer Danny here today, and man, I've been to some really cool places today actually. Um, the trip was really nice, I got to see, oh man, so many abandoned places, to be honest with you. This place is like abandoned city. So I saw the AMC, you know, headquarters, that was pretty cool. Um, right now, I'm actually at a hotel. Um, supposedly this place closed in 2008, and that's really all I got on it. But there's a pool here, there's the ballroom, a lot of things are left behind and I'm here to capture and document the things that I find. So, supposedly, if we go upstairs, there are 12 floors, and there are things literally on each floor, and I'm cool with that. So, we don't destroy, we don't vandalize things, we don't break anything, we don't steal anything. Um, I just wanna let you guys know that, because a lot of people think we do that, and I don't wanna give ur urban explorers bad names, so. Appreciate you guys for watching. Um, if you guys are new, make sure you hit that bell button. Um, you can even comment notification squad and I'll give you guys a shout out. Thanks. Will Wessner, I have to give my shout out to you, man. You've been, you stuck with me for two years and you've always watched my videos. You're a cool guy. And whenever I go down to Seattle, dude, we're gonna hang out or we can, I don't know, get some food, chill. I really appreciate it, man. Um, shout out to you. Yeah. So we're at the restaurant part of this place. It's actually really cool. They have the bar here. And there's also the ballroom around here. Um, I'm gonna show that later and come back. But yeah, I'd like to actually see the real hotel, which is upstairs. See, look at that. It's cool, they actually still have the seats too. <gasps> yeah. Wow, this place looks really vintage. Really old school. <sighs> It's a casing for like an old school TV. It's one thing that I've noticed about every abandoned place I've been to. There's always gotta be a piano. And this one's cool. Yeah, see, right? This one's cool, because it actually... Oh, don't make me a liar, come on. There we go, it actually still plays. <laughs> Sir, I'd like to have a Tito's and Sprite, please. Okay, well, <laughs> you're short on luck because we're all out of Tito's and we're all out of Sprite. Oh, come on. You guys are supposed to have excellent service here. They actually still have, like, abstract paintings here. So they didn't really completely gut this place out. They did take out most of the furniture, though. have this elevator <laughs> dude imagine this thing collapses anywho yeah man i want to press the buttons look Ooh. right now i'm headed to the pool i just want to show you guys really quick this is actually really awesome i love the lighting of this place honestly that's why i'm definitely headed over here look at that folks look at that so i had to show you guys this pool it's funny they still have a bench inside there um, they boarded everything off, so I'm assuming it's an even bigger pool, but we can't go out there yet. Um, it leads actually to outside, so that's pretty dope. So it's actually so cold here that the pool actually froze. And for some reason, somebody left a bench in there. That's really funny to me, actually. Shout out to the mystery woman. Um, for those of you who don't know, she's an Instagrammer, so you're not going to find her on YouTube yet. Maybe she'll do videos one day, we don't know. But she's on Instagram, the mystery woman. The underscore mystery woman. Yeah. <laughs> so, follow our guys. Folks, look at this. this is, I think this is the ballroom. Look at the chandeliers. They're not even, like, damaged. <laughs> oh, <shit>. God damn it. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, is that a... Yeah. That's from that? Yeah, what if that actually fell on us? So some of it is damaged. I don't want to be a liar. Yeah, right? <laughs> I think you can see the state. Um, one thing that I am wondering is if the damage was from natural decay or did somebody actually come in here and damage the place? I actually don't know. So my next goal is to probably get upstairs and see what I can find. Um, supposedly there's things left behind here and I'm trying to find that guys, I really am. I'm kind of curious what's inside these rooms, to be honest. Oh, wow. Yeah, it was like a Chinese pillow over here. I'm not being racist, by the way. I am 25% Chinese. Oh, okay. Um, looks like there's some office equipment. Trophies. What else? What is on this table? Some fabric. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at that. So, a cool thing that we actually found was the old photography god damn it was the old photos that they used to have of this building really cool stuff i almost want to take one which honestly i might i ain't gonna lie to you guys so so they used to have an old buffet and really cool stuff around here dinner shows the whole nine yards in the bed i don't know Oops. i just want to look in here anyways wow wow folks take a look at this room this room it's actually really cool that they actually left the mattress there like i said every abandoned hotel usually is gutted out when i go so it's different oh my god look at this place it looks like it looks like that it's a therapeutic like bath yeah somebody got bored and they shot um fire extinguisher stuff in there but yeah I really think it's a therapeutic bath. I think it's like they put salt, like somebody wrote salt right there. Yeah, somebody wrote salt here. So they put you in a bath basically with salt water and you just kind of like hibernate in there or you meditate or whatever. So really cool stuff. I actually didn't think they'd have something like this in here. I gotta get the, I want a photo of this thing. Damn, the shower though. Even the, oh, even the shower is actually really cool. It's not your conventional shower look. That makes too much noise, but it basically closes in a circle, and that's pretty cool. We got a couple of small pieces and the crap to them. Making All right, I need some. Uh... Dang, which one, guys? I'll do the the, the breakfast <laughs> bacon. Wow, <laughs> you actually gave me your bacon. That's so cool. I'm just telling her how hungry I was. Appreciate it. You're welcome. So I'm always saying that we always capture things frozen in time. Well, there you have it, folks. Literally frozen in time. That's how you know how cold it is out here. We're literally in 20 degree weather, still exploring, dedicated. So what'd you find there? The Holy Bible. <sighs> That's weird that it's actually in a room. And still here. Yep. Dusty as fuck though. Yeah. Look at that. It's probably from 2008, who knows? <laughs> but yeah, these are what the- That's what's kept all this stuff in this place. Yeah. It's religion. We don't want to touch that. We don't mess around with religion here, <laughs> especially in these videos, but just want to show you guys like these are what the rooms consist of pretty much two beds and the cool thing is they're not empty literally the mattresses are still there i kind of have an idea of what might have happened um they might have opened business at a wrong time and the place was probably empty and they were probably getting hit with bill after bill and they probably couldn't keep up so guys they actually have the cover still on this There's probably bed bugs on here <laughs> it'd be so gross is it? It is. Where? <laughs> oh my god, folks. I'm, li I'm literally out of breath. Oh. <laughs> was that you? No. That wasn't me. I'm literally out of breath. <laughs> it's like the 14th floor. It was probably her. But, um, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I skipped like five floors. So, we're gonna keep going. See if I can find those sweets. I mean, this is kind of like a sweet, but I was expecting it to be a little bit bigger. But <sighs> beggars can't be choosers, I guess, huh? <laughs> Thank you. 
for me. Hello? You got, you got the count of 10. Get out or I'm gonna light you guys up. I swear, you're gonna be forced to come out. Yo, you keep banging, I swear. You're done, kid, I swear. <laughs> or, yeah, we'll just fire right there. Okay. All right, Dan, you get lit up. And then I'll just, just record really quick. Fire. Fire. <laughs> All right, folks, so right now we have. <laughs> Right now we're at the suite. Ah, man, we finally found it. They have really nice couches. And they actually have a kitchen inside the same room. Look at that. I wonder what's inside this fridge. Oh, look. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. Hello? Dude, we smoked, we smoked you out. Wow. <laughs> no, because I, I started coughing on this shit. But, did you guys see, wait, did you guys see the place I was just in? Uh, <laughs> I'm getting coughed up, but this guy right here, Max Power. Strange what places up? with Max Power. Strange places, we know places to go through and dare Exactly. Use used the prankster. I thought he was a bum. <laughs> not gonna, not gonna lie, so we used the fire extinguisher to literally lure him out. And it worked, but... but it back, it might have backfired, folks. So, hear that there's not that much more, and I wish there was, but it's not. So, I'm probably gonna end this here. Thanks for watching. Peace.